Good morning. All right, so let's go ahead and stand up at the top of your mats. That's just like a yoga term that I've started saying. Oh, we have a friend. Okay, so we're gonna stand it up. We're gonna go ahead and face this wall this way. We're just gonna start with a reverse lunge. So keep that chest up nice and tall. Lunge that right leg back, reach those arms up overhead. Get those hips opened up. And then bring that right foot forward. We'll bring that left leg back. So if you just joined me, you need a stability ball if you have one, or those furniture gliders or um, paper plates if you have them, and a little band for your ankle. Bring that left foot up, right leg goes back. Right foot goes forward, left leg goes back. Bring that left foot forward. Now that right foot goes back. Drop that knee down. Bring that right hand down to the ground for me. We're just going to do those chest openers. So opening up that chest, close it back down. We'll go for five. Open up that chest. Close it back down for four. Open it up. Three. Two. And one. So. Left foot steps back. Now we'll bring that right foot forward, drop that knee down, open up that chest on the opposite side. So you'll probably have to scoot that left hand in a little bit closer. Those three, give me two more. Four. And last one, four or five. Good job. All right, so we're gonna walk our hands all the way back to the mat, forward fold right here. Grab those opposite elbows, press through those heels, just add some length through those hamstrings, and then we'll walk it out, add that inchworm. Just a little push up if you'd like it, and then walk those hands all the way back to the feet, forward fold. Press that way through the heels, tuck that chin into your chest. Let's walk it back out, find that high plank. Add that push up if you'd like, walk it all the way back, forward fold. We'll do two more, walk it all the way out. I'm staying in that forward fold position rather than standing up just because my hamstrings are a little tender from yesterday. So I'm trying to add some length through there. One more time, we'll walk it out. Add those push ups and walk it all the way back. All right, one more thing before we get started. So we're just gonna do an in-place jump rope. So just like your jumping rope, but it's invisible. So if you just join me, if you have a stability ball, if you have one of those little ankle bands, if you don't have a stability ball, you could use furniture gliders or you can use paper plates if you have them. All right, we'll go for five, four, three, two, and one. Okay, so each of these are only gonna have two exercises per set, so it'll feel like it's going hopefully a little bit faster. So I'm gonna demonstrate the two exercises, and then we're gonna go through three sets, okay? So first one, you can grab dumbbells if you'd like. Our right leg is gonna go forward. We're just lunging down and up. So staying in that static position, okay? So that's gonna be our first exercise. So you're not going backwards and forwards, just down and up. Second exercise is gonna be that single leg deadlift. So if you need a wall or something to balance on, just down and up like so, okay? So we'll do those two exercises. We'll do three sets of that. If that single leg deadlift bothers you, you can always go into like a one arm row or something instead, okay? So, going 
Go ahead and grab those dumbbells. We're gonna start with that right leg forward. We'll do those static lunges on that right side. So just down and up for one, two, three, four, five, one, two, three, four, ten. Give me five more for five, four, three, two. And one, good job. All right, left leg goes forward. <clears throat> Same thing for one, two, three, four, five, one, two, three, four, ten. Give me five more for five, four, three two, and one. Step that foot forward. <clears throat> Grab that one heavier dumbbell. We have those single leg deadlifts. So I'm gonna hold the dumbbell in my left hand. I'm standing on that left foot. Keep my hips nice and level down. We'll go for one. Stand it up. Two, three, hips are level, four, Five, one, two, three, four, ten. Give me five more. Keep those hips nice and level for one, two, three, four, one more, and five. All right, spin it around, stand on that right foot, weight goes in that right hand. Make sure there's nothing behind you. For one, two, three, core is tight, draw that belly button back, four, five, good job. One, two, Three, four, ten. Give me that five more. For five, four, three, two, and one. All right, place that weight down. You'll grab those lighter dumbbells if you want them for these static lunges. I'm going to go without this time because I'm running later. So, right foot goes forward. Like I need to give you a reason. Down and up for one, two, three, four, five. Good job. One, chest is tall. Two, three, four, ten. Give me five more for five, four, three. Two and one. All right, left leg goes forward. Down and up for me. For one, two, three, four, five, one, two, three, four, ten. Give me five more. Five. Four, three, two, and one. Good job. All right, we're back to that heavy dumbbell, guys. Standing on that left foot, holding that weight in your left hand. Keeping a good crank going here. Let's go. Hips are level for one. Two, slight bend through that left knee. Three, four, Five, one, keep that weight nice and close to that body. Two, three, four, ten. Give me five more. Five, four, three, 
four, three, two, and one. Spin it around for me. <clears throat> Standing on that right foot, weight goes into that right hand. Again, make sure that area behind you is clear. Let's go. For one, two, three. Slide bend through this right knee now. Four, five, one, two, three, four. Time, give me five more. For five, four, three, two, and one. All right, guys, we have one more set of these guys before we move on. So grab those dumbbells if you want them. If not, place the hands on the hips like so. That right foot goes forward. Give me that 15 on that right side. For one, two, three, four, five, one, two, you got it. Three, four, ten. Give me five more for five, four, three, two, and one. Good job. All right, left leg goes forward. Obviously, the dumbbells are going to make this more difficult, guys. Let's do it for one, two, three, four. Five, one, two, three, four, ten. Give me five more. Fight the bird for five, four, take it low, three, two, and one. All right. Last set of these single leg deadlifts, and we don't see them again. So grab that weight left and left. Stand on there and let's go. For one, two, three, four, you got it, five, one, two, three, four, Time, keep those hips level, keep that forearm good. Five more for five, four, three, two, and one. Good job. All right, right and right. Finish it up strong here. Let's go. For one, two, three, Four, five, good job. One, two, three, four, ten, five more. Hips stay level, don't turn out towards that wall. One, two, three, two more. Four, last one and five. All right, so I'm gonna grab my mat and my stability ball. I'll show you what you're doing if you have those gliders. If you have nothing, you're just gonna do hip thrusts. So we're gonna do leg curls and ball passes. So I'm gonna show you each of those and then I'll give you the modification. So laying on your back, <clears throat> hips up, feet on the ball, and you're just rolling in, flexing those toes back towards your face, okay? I don't have my furniture gliders over here or plates, but if you have those, you can do that same thing with the hips up and just glide, bend the knees in, if you can see what I'm doing, but you'll have your hips up. I just can't do it without them. Um, second exercise, if you have none of those things, just do those weighted hip thrusts, okay? So you have three options there. Second exercise is gonna be those ball passes. So 
stability ball pass like this. If you don't have that ball, we'll just do V-ups instead. So up and touch and back down, okay? So we'll get started. So laying on those back sides, hands are down at your sides. Lift those hips up nice and high. Roll it in for one, two, we're doing 50. Three, keep those hips up nice and high. Flex those toes back towards your face. Five, one, you got it. Two, three, four, 10, keep it going. Keep those hips up. One, two, three, four, 15, you got it. One, two, three, four, 20, keep it going. One, two, three, feel that burn. Four, we're halfway there. Five, keep it going. One, two, three, four, 10, give me 20 more. One, two, three, four, five, last 15. One, two, three, four, five. Give me 10 more for 10, nine, eight, seven, six, five, four, three, two, and one, good job. All right, now we go straight into that ball pass or that V up. Every time it hits that hand, that's one, two. Keep that back nice and flat. Only go until you feel that lower back lifting off the mat. So you shouldn't have a big arch in that back. There's five. You got it. We're halfway there, there's 10. Keep pushing that belly into that mat for one, two, keep it going. Give me six more, one, two, last four. Three more, you got it. One. Two. And last one. Good job. All right, so now we're gonna stand it up, guys. First exercise is gonna be standing. Second exercise is gonna be laying down. So the first one's gonna be curtsy lunges, okay? So I'm gonna use one dumbbell right at my chin, just curtsy side to side, okay? So we'll do 15 of those on each side. Second exercise we're going to do laying down. You're doing that single leg hip thrust. So one foot's on the ground, the other's in the air. You lift up for one, two, and those will be 15 on each side, okay? We'll do three sets of that. So go ahead and grab that one dumbbell for those curtsy lunges. We'll place it just below the chin. Stand it up nice and tall for me. Scoot my mat over just a little bit. And let's go. One. Keep that balance, nice control. Two. Three. Good job. Four. Five, give me 10 more. One. Two. You got it. Three. Four. 10, last five. One. 
two, three, two more, four, last one each side, and five. All right, so lay on that back side. We'll start with that left foot up in the air. Right knee is bent, right foot is flat on the ground. Lift it up and squeeze for one, two, it's a little move, three, four, five, one, two, three, four, ten. Give me five more for five, four, three, two, one. Left foot goes down, right foot goes up in the air. Let's do it for one. Two, three, four, five. Lift it up and squeeze. One, two, three, four, ten. Give me five more for five, four, three, two, and one. Good job. Hug those knees in really fast. We'll work our way back up. We're back to those curtsy lunges. So again, add that weight if you'd like. I'm gonna go without this time. So if you have that weight, just place it right below the chin. If not, hands can go on hips. Let's do it, curtsy lunge, keep moving. One, nice control here. Two, three, nice job guys. Four, Five, keep it going. One, two, three, ooh, four, ten. Give me five more, then we head back down to the mat for five, four. Three, two, give me one more each side, and one. All right, head down to the mat for me. Right foot stays on the mat, hands are at the sides, left leg raises up, give me those hip thrusts for 15, for one, two, three, Lift it up and squeeze. Four, try to keep those hips level. Five. One, two, three, four. Keep pushing. 10, give me five more for five. Four, three, two, and one. Left leg goes down, bend that knee. Right leg goes high to the sky. Lift it up for one, two, Three, four, five, one, two, three. Lift and squeeze. Four, make sure you're working that glute. Ten, five more for five, four, three, two, and one. All right, we've got one more set. Stand it up nice and tall. Grab that dumbbell for me. Let's do it. Curtsy lunge for one, two, three, four, five. Good job. Keep it going. One. Two, three, four, ten. Give me five more. Five. Stay with me. Push it out. Four, three, two. Give me one more each side. 
and done. All right, so we head back down to the mat. We're gonna stay down there. So we'll need that gliders or the stability ball. If you have it, get it nearby for me. <clears throat> All right, so left leg goes up first. We have those single leg hip thrusts. Give me 15 for one, two, three, four, up and squeeze, five, one, two, three, four, ten. Give me five more for five. Push it up. Four, three, two, and one. All right. Left leg goes down. Right leg goes high to the sky. Lift it up for me for one, two, three, four, five, one, two, three, four, ten. Give me five more for five, four, three, two, and one. All right. I'm rolling that stability ball in or grab those gliders or plates. <clears throat> this time we're going half time on this. So we have 25 of these and 10 ball passes. So lift those hips up nice and high for me. Flex those toes back towards your face. Let's roll it in for one, two, three, four, five. Nice job. One, two, three, four, ten. Keep it going. One, two, three, four. Five, give me 10 more for 10, nine, eight, seven, six, five, four, three, two, one. All right, lower those hips down. Now we have those ball passes or V ups. So let's pass it. Keep that belly button nice and flat on the ground. Let's go for one. Really control those legs as you bring them down, whether you're doing the VFs or the ball passes. Two. Nice and slow. Three. Don't rush through this, guys. Four. Five. Six. Seven. Three more. Eight, nine, one more. Give me that 10. Good job. All right, roll that ball aside for me. We're gonna stand it up. We're gonna need that little loopy band. <clears throat> so the band is gonna go on your ankles. If you don't have the band, that's okay for today. Just mimic what I'm doing, but take it down a little bit lower. If you need a band, let me know. I can get you one. All right, so band goes today on the calves. Maybe I cannot fall while I'm doing this. All right, so down on these calves. The first move we're gonna do, we bend those knees, we're going side to side. So we'll do 15 of those, okay? Second move we're gonna do, take those feet nice and wide, Give me a kick up to that booty. So like a standing leg curl machine. We'll do 15 of those each side. We'll do three sets of that. At the end of that, we're gonna scoot the band all the way up to the thighs and do some laying hip thrusts with that, okay? Too much information right now. Okie doke. So get that band on guys, I'll give you just a second. Hands go on your hips. We'll squat those knees down nice and low. Let's go to the side for one. Two, three, four. Really press with those glutes, those outer thighs. Five, six, seven. Keep it going. Eight, nine, ten. Give me five more for five, four, three, 
two, and one. All right, so I'm keeping my legs out nice and wide. I just have a nice little bend through my knees. I'll go sideways so you can see here. We'll kick it up for one. Trying to get that heel almost all the way to that booty. Three, four, five, one, two, three, squeeze it, four, ten. Give me five more. Five, four, three, two, and one. Good job. All right, fix my band. It rolled up, which is totally fine. But when you do these, you want it nice and flat if you're able to get it nice and flat. All right, so we're back to those side steps, guys. We're just burning it out with three sets back to back. So get low for me, take it side to side. For one, two, burn it out, three, five, one, two, three, you got it, four, ten, give me five more, five, nice big steps, four, three, two, and one, good job. All right, so take those feet nice and wide. We'll kick it up, stand up nice and tall, right and left for one, two, three. There's five, one, two, three, four, keep pushing. 10, give me five more. Keep those feet wide for five, four, three, two, and one. Good job. All right, so we have one more set of these suckers. And then, like I said, we'll scoot the band all the way up to the thighs and lay it down for some hip thrusts. All right, so let's take those feet nice and wide, guys. 15 steps, side to side. Let's go for one. Two, three, four, you got it. Five, push it out. One, two, three, four, time, keep stepping, go wide. Five, four, three, two, and one. All right. So take those feet nice and wide. Last one of these booty kickers. Try to keep them nice and wide. Try, try to keep that pressure on those outer thighs as you kick it up. For one, two, three, four, five, one, two, three, Four, keep them wide. 10, five, four, three, two, one more each side and one. All right, good job. So I'm gonna roll this all the way up to my thighs now, okay? We're laying back on the mat. We're gonna do those double leg hip thrusts. We're just gonna do 30 of them. Okay, so we're pressing out against the band as you go. If you want an additional dumbbell to place on your hips, you can go ahead and grab that right now, okay? So just to demo, we're just gonna press up and out, come back down, press up and out. So grab that dumbbell if you need it. If not, we will get going. So lay it down, hands at sides, lift it up for one, two, three, four, really push it out, five, one, two, press out against that band as you push up, three, four, burn it out, 10, one, two, three, four, 15, halfway there, one, 
two, three, up and squeeze, four, five, give me 10 more. Let's go for one. Feel that burn in those glutes too. Two, three, four, five more. Lift it up and squeeze for five, four, up and squeeze, three, two, last one, and one. Good job. All right, so let's take this band off. We're gonna grab that ball or those gliders one more time. We're doing 15 and five. So we have 15 of those leg curls, five of those ball passes. So heels go on that ball, hips go up nice and high. Let's do it, 15, flex those toes back towards your face for one, two, three, four, five, one, two, three, four, ten. Give me five more. Lift those hips up an inch higher for me for five, four, three, two, one. All right, we just have those five ball passes. So make them good ones. So place that ball between your legs. Draw that belly button down into the mat. Give me one, two, three, four, last one, and five. Nice job. Okay. So up next is when things get really fun. So we're gonna do a wall sit. If you don't have a wall that you can sit on, you can always do a squat hold. I'm gonna use, because I'm a little sweaty, I'm gonna use my ball so I don't mess up my paint. So let me demo what that would look like. So if we're doing a wall sit with the ball, this just goes in my lower back and then I squat it down and hold, okay? If you just wanna do a squat hold, We'll hold that like so, okay? So we're gonna do a 30 second wall sit. We'll go into 20 plank jacks or 20 plank jack step outs after that, 20 squat jumps. We'll do three sets of that back to back. Okie doke, so I'm gonna grab my timer and we'll get all situated with whatever situation you need in order to do that wall sit. Get this all set for 30 seconds. Make sure you go down nice and low with this one, guys. So let's place that ball on the wall or just you go against the wall. Lower it down, ready? And count starts now. So no hands on the thighs as I almost tried to place them there. Maybe put them at heart center or on your hips or do a little whatever with them. Place them on your shoulders. Just don't place them on your thighs because then you're cheating. 15 more seconds, nobody wants that. Give me 10. Push it out, guys. Draw that belly button in for five, four, three, two, and done. Good job. All right, let's take it down to the mat. We have our plank jacks or our plank step outs. Find that low plank position. Hop or step it out for one, two, three, four. Five, one, two, three, four, ten. Halfway there, one, two, three, four, five more. For five, four, three, two, one. Good job. All right, so we're going to stand it up. Now we have the squat jump. So if you want to take that jump out, you can just do regular squats. Squat jumps or regular squats. Let's go. For one, two, three, four, five, one, two, three, four. It's okay to squat it out. Ten. Give me ten more. For one, two, three, four, five more. Five, four, three, two, and one. So we're going for power here. So I want you to get right back into this, guys. It's three sets back to back. 
That way we're gonna be able to get through the whole program I have for today. So grab that ball, just sit against the wall. You have 30 seconds to catch your breath while you're doing this. Keep that chest up nice and tall. All right, let's lower it down. Go. Again, no hands on thighs, hands at heart center, on the shoulders. You see I have a nice 90 degree angle with my legs. I'm not up nice and high. We're halfway there. Push it out, feel that burn. 10 seconds to go. Five, three, two, one. Good job, all right. So we're back to those plank jacks, guys. So I'm rolling this ball out of the way. That way it doesn't try to come and find me. So find those forearms. Let's plank jack it out for one, two, three, four, five. Just hold a plank if you want. One, two, three, four, ten. Halfway there. One, two, three, four. Five more for five, four, three, two, one. Good job. All right, so we stand it up. We have those squat jumps or squats. Your call, guys. Let's go. For one, two, three, four, five, one, two, three, four. 10, halfway there. One, two, three, four, five. Give me five more, then we go straight into this next set. For five, four, three, two, one. All right, straight into this last set, guys. No better time than now. Then we have one more round of exercises. So. Place this ball right in that lower back or just squat against that wall. Let's go, 30 seconds. Can't see. No hands on the thighs. Make sure you're low. We're halfway there. Give me 10. Last five. And time. Good job. All right, one more set of plank jacks. One more set of squat jumps. So go ahead and find that plank position for me, guys. Hop or step it out for one, two, three, four, five, one. Two, three, four, ten. One, two, three, four, five more. Five, four, three, two, one. All right, last set of squat jumps. Stand it up. Catch that breath. Get that chest up nice and tall. Let's go. For one, two, three. Four, five, one, two, three, four, ten. Halfway there, keep pushing, stay low. One, two, three, four, five more. Five, four, three, two, and one. All right, guys, good job. You made it through that one. So. Up next, we're gonna have fire hydrants and tic tac lunges. Fire hydrants are gonna be 20 on each side. If you have a band and you wanna use it, you can. Tic tac lunges are gonna be 10 on each side, so I'll demonstrate. So fire hydrants, you'll be down on the mat. Make that tabletop position. Lift that left leg up for one, two. That's what that one looks like, okay? Tic tac lunges. You're gonna put your hands on your hips or grab dumbbells if you want them. You'll go forward with the right, back with the right, okay? And then 
after you do 10 on that side, you'll go do a 10 on the left side, okay? So, let's get all situated here. We'll start with those TikTok lunges. We'll start on that right side. So go ahead and stand it up nice and tall for me. One. Two. Again, weights will make this harder. Three. Four. Five more. Five. Four. Three. Two. One. All right, we have that left side. Let's go. For one. Two. Three. But this side is not talented for me. Four. Five. Six. Seven. Eight, two more. Nine. Last one. And 10. All right, take it down to the mat. Find that tabletop position for me. Make sure those wrists are just below those shoulders. You're not dumping weight into them. We'll start on that right leg. Lift it up for one, two, keep those hip level, three, Four, five, one, two, three, four, ten. Halfway there. One, two, three, four, five more. Five, four, three, two, one. All right, left leg goes. Lift it up for one, two, three, four, five, one, two, three, four, ten. We're halfway there. One, two, three, four, five more, five, four. Three, two, one. Good job. All right, so we're standing back up. We're back to those TikTok lunges. Back to those TikTok lunges. So I'm gonna go facing forward this time. I feel like that might work out a little bit better for me. All right, let's go. Right side. One, two, Three, four, five, one, two, three, four, ten. Good job. All right, left side. Let's go. No pausing. One. Two, still not good at the left side. Three, four, five, we're halfway there. You got it guys, fight that burn. Five, four, three, two, and one. Good job, all right. Let's do those fire hydrants. So find that tabletop position, place those wrists just below your shoulders. You can tell my brain's not working. Draw that belly button up to your spine. 20 on the right side, let's go. For one, two, three, four, five, one, two, Three, four, ten, one, two, 
three, four, five more. You got it. Five, four, three, two, one. All right, left side goes, guys. Lift it up for one, two, three, four, five, one, two, three, four, ten. Halfway there. One, two, three, four, five more. Five, four, three, two, one. All right, guys, we got just one more set. And then we're going to go into a quick stretch before I let you go today. So we'll be done right at 30 after. We got about eight minutes. So stand it up nice and tall, roll those shoulder blades back. Let's do these last tick-tock lunges. So lunge it forward. One, two, three, four, five, one, two, three, four, ten. Good job. All right, left side. Let's go. For one, two, three, four, five, halfway there, one, two, three, two more, four, last one, five, good job, all right, bring it down to the mat for me, place those hands below your shoulders, right leg begins, let's go, for one, two, three, four, five, one, two, three, four, ten, one, two, three, four, five more, five, four, three, two, one. All right, left leg, get it up nice and high. You got it for one, two, three, four, five. Finish strong, guys. This is it. One, two, three, four, ten. Halfway there, lift it up. One, two, three, four, five more. Push it out. Five. Four, three, two, and one. Good job. You did it. All right, so let's stretch it out just really fast. We're going to come into a tree position, seated on the ground. So placing that left foot on the inside of that right thigh, guys. Let's square those hips forward. Inhale those arms up overhead, and then forward fold, grabbing below the ball of your foot. So just forward fold into that right side. We had a lot with the hamstrings today. So you just want to make sure you get those stretched out. It's going to be a little windy later, but a decent day. So if you can get outside, get on a walk or a run, that would be good. Now we'll take this right hand, place it on the inside of that right foot, lift that left arm up and over. So stretch through that side body too with deadlifts yesterday and today that lower back might be a little sore. So make sure you keep it stretched out. Then we're just gonna switch sides. So now bringing that left leg forward, right foot goes on the inside of that left leg, forward fold for me, square those hips. Try to press that back of that left knee down to the ground as much as you can. Place that left hand on the inside of that left foot. Reach that arm up and over. Hands 
And then we're just gonna finish it out with a little butterfly stretch here. So place both those feet together, forward fold for me, stretching out in those inner thighs. So using those elbows to press down on those knees. So tomorrow's gonna be cardio. So make sure you join me for that. And then Saturday will just kind of be total, total body fun and chaos. All right, guys, great job, everybody. Give yourself a little round of applause. Have a wonderful day. Thank you so much for joining me.